Hi, this tutorial is teaching you about to, how to create website, uh, connecting, how to create website by the WordPress and connecting with the web server. Okay, the first time if you want to create one website, the first you should download the file the WordPress from the website. Now I have the file I, I show the website that you want to download WordPress. I join to Google. And one more website, I'm Google also because Google is the worldwide in the world. I can search all the application and the programming. Okay, now WordPress. I type on the WordPress.org. WordPress.org. This one is good. And this one I, I put on the WAM server. Because when I create a website, I must use the WAM server. WAM server. WordPress.org. WAM server. Okay, the internet is slow. Okay, this website is the program that you download from the website wordpress.com. You can click press on this one and you can download. And Bam Server also, this is a website. If you want to download Bam Server, click on download. You will see the 64 bit on 32 bit. So you can choose by yourself, or depend on your computer. Uh, now I have already to download on the wordpress. This is to my file on uh, installing WordPress and I extract it. Okay, this is WordPress and I, uh, I also I install WAM server is done already. This is my WAM server. Okay, I make test on WAM server. Okay, I click on root and after I enter. No. Root. I click go. Okay, one server is logged in done, and we can see all the data. And you want to download that, create the data, actual and starter. Okay, now, now I, I need to close it, and I extract WordPress. This is WordPress zip file, but now I extract already. Now I click on WordPress. And I need to copy all files in the WordPress. Copy into Drive C. I copy and I turn to the WAM. WAM WW. And after I create a new folder, this is the title. I using on the testing. 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 Okay, I pass on this one. Uh, now I'm I pass already. I pass already. So I I turn to I re, I in I go into the my admin one more time. I click on root. I click go, and after we can see a lot of. To make test and now I need to create the database and create database I my database is that testing also testing okay create now the database is testing has been created so you can see this database okay now I have already for the create database on warm server and now I, I I enter I go into the drive C one more time and I click to one server I click to I enter to the WW and also I go to the testing this file is for config config on this file so now I need to append it not pad 
because I like the notepad. Wow. Man, W comfort simple. I open with with the Okay. Now I need to change them. I need to change them on the database. Oh, this is the database work fresh. Okay, this here it should change to your name testing. Testing. Now the the database name is testing, and my actual name, my actual name. When when me my actual and username. Username. I click on root. I put on root and the uh, database password. No need. And the uh, host file. I need to use the local host. Okay, now I did already. So I click on save file. Now, uh, my editing is just done. So I click on save file. And I'm going to the web server one more time. I restart all service. <sighs> Waiting on web server is restarting. The web server is offline. Waiting until the. Okay, start all service again. We think maybe the three minute. Okay. Now I join to the my PHP admin. And I click And one more, I, I need to the log into the website that you create the name of the testing. I click on local host, local host, click on the call host, slash the name of your website, testing, testing, and slash WP. WP no WP dot admin WP dot admin slash installation no slash install dot PHP okay now you can click enter oh the work fresh is combined with the web server so the first we the WordPress asks you about the language that you want to choose. I choose the Internet United States, and you can welcome to WordPress before you get started. You need some information. Okay, I upload it already, and now the database name. The database name. I click on the my database name is testing, and username. Username. I click on the uh, I need to put on root username I click root and password it is up to me this is my password and local how I just said I click WP admin. The brief click. Admin. Okay, and submit. The area is established database connection. Uh, WP that database name root and submit. Error password 
my number of phone. Oh, are you sure that username and correct database name testing username? I click on a uh, username, click BR. We are no need to create password. Your actual name, actual name admin. That's what. Okay, now the complete uh, information is already. I, I don't want to use password, my testing username, and then I click the submit and install now. The complete. I click on continue. And now the web frame is showing for you installation. Okay, now the title on the web file on the website. This is just title. I need to put the title on the BL my title and username. I click on root, root, and password. I need to use my password. I click on confirm password. My email address, Jerosa. Number three at gmail at gmail dot com. I click on this inquiry installing WordPress. Sorry, the white about email is really it look like username and password. Oh, the white about it made a try at Rosa at no, I come show gmail dot com. This is my password. I need to take my password because I'm afraid I forget. Okay. Now I click on confirm WordPress. Install WordPress. Okay, now the WordPress is installing your username and your password. I log in. I click on root my password that I'm put. I'm log in. Okay, this is the website that I'm installed with the WAM server. You can edit by yourself. You yourself. Mm, this is my website. Okay, thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please subscribe and share this video.